Yo, what's up, bros? It's your friend Paul from Handsome Virgin. There's a story of two bros. The first bro, he goes to high school. Okay? He's brand new to the school, bros. He's brand new, and I know I'm looking super sexy. Thank you very much, thanks. And he enters the school, the building. He starts looking around. He sees some bros, just goes in quietly. It's just in that comfort zone, you know? Just like trying to be as comfortable as possible. Just trying to not disturb anything. Just trying to be, just trying to fit in. And it's understandable, he's trying to fit in, right? He walks to the guys that it seemed to be most like him. And he's like, yo, what are you guys checking out? Or whatever. And he starts hanging out with some dudes that like games as well. They like playing Batman, okay? They talk about Batman. They hang out there. Um, when he sees the girls, the girls walk by. He sees them, he looks at them. The guys that are with him also look at them. Just turn their heads with them like that. Flipping like that. Screw that stuff, by the way. And... Um, they just watch, they just watch that, 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 hey bro, they just watch those girls. And then they see those girls turn their heads towards who? Towards some bros that are energetic and they see, oh, it's the cool kids. And the girls are looking at the cool kids and the girls look. And then there, there's Brad. There's, um, what other jockey names are there? There's Philip. There's, what else can it be? It's Paul. It's flipping who else, man? It's flipping Roger. It's flipping whatever, dude. And there's the guys. Yeah, they're going past. Yeah, yeah, yo, bro, bro, bro. High fives and everything. Some people laugh at them. Some people like ah. Tsh. Some people like ah. Yeah, those are the cool kids. Not a run. And they're always going somewhere. Those bros. And they walk past, and the girls are like, oh, oh, that guy there in the middle. That guy there. Oh, he's so cool. He's so amazing. So flipping. So flipping epic. And so and so and so forth. And um. Yeah, and so the other guys are like flipping, just watching them, just watching them, watch them. Okay. <laughs> and so, that bro, the new bro, okay? Bro number one. So bro number one came into the school and stuff, then he sees a girl that he likes, so then he goes to that girl. And he's like, yo, hey, can I get your number? And she's like... I uh, know, and she walks away, and it's like, oh, shucks, oh, and whenever he goes around, she always has that look, like she's like, but away from him, he's like, oh, he's really trying to get in there, Brr. so, that's bro number one, he was new to the school, now here's bro number two, okay, let me tell you guys a secret, bro number one and bro number two saw each other, okay, and you're gonna see where that happened, okay, here's bro number two, Bro number two comes to the school. He's got his own goals. He's got his own plan. He knows what he wants to do. He knows why he's in the school. He knows what he wants to do after school. He decided. He has this passion that he's following. He doesn't care if people fucking think about him, okay? He comes to the school. He knows he wants to get involved in sports. He loves running. He loves gymming. He knows that he loves people because he, he, he would challenge himself to go out and just meet people and make friends with people. And he loves making people feel good about themselves. And he loves feeling good and seeing others smile as well. So he goes. And then he's walking and then he sees some bros. He just walks past. He sees some bros there. Was he lifting some weights? And he starts talking to them. He's like, yo, what, what are you lifting? And they start joking and talking about stuff. And they're just having a genuine fucking conversation. He's not trying to blend in, he's not trying to fit in, he's not trying to do anything, he's just being himself. And they start laughing. Um, and then they're like high-fiving, they're like, ha ha, man, ah, it's so funny. Because when you're genuine, you know, jokes that are good jokes have some fucking truth to them. Ha 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 ha, that's a joke, but it's true, and it's hilarious, okay? <laughs> okay, they have some truth to them, funny jokes, okay? Um, so they laugh, they're being genuine. And now they're attracting attention because they're laughing. They're not even trying to do that, they're just having fun, they're just being themselves. And so some people are there and they're like, and those guys are now introducing the people to this new bro who's telling, he's complimenting them, the new bro, bro number two. He's like, 
yo, dude, Duke, dude, oh man, I love your shoes, dude, where do you get them from? It's like, yo, he got it from here and here and here, and he loves this color, and it's like, yo, dude, that's a totally flipping cool color. And then there's some girls there with them as well, and there's some other people there, and now the people are busy looking at him and talking, and they're talking, and they're talking, and one of the girls tries to, like, say something about something that he says. Does he turn there to, to say something to her? Nah, he's not interested in that. He's talking to his broski. And they're having a fun time, they're connecting. What, what they are focused on is important to them, okay? So they keep talking and they're like just connected. They're just connected and they're like, yo, they're like soul bros. This is like some real bromance up in here, bros. Like my broski Pelage and I, shout out to you, Pelage. Like if we were together, dudes, if we were together, that would be a perfect fucking example of bro love, dude. And bro love, when you unashamed, when you have unashamed bro love, that is when you are in this awesome space, okay? That is when you are in this epic space. Nothing else fucking matters. Just you, your goals, your dreams, and bro love, okay? Um, Palash is Splash, by the way. Shout out to Splash Palash. And, um, yeah, so. When he's walking through the hall with his newfound friends, they're not afraid of stuff. They laugh at stuff. They talk about stuff. They're making a loud noise. It's doing whatever the flip they want to do. Okay? And now, as they're walking, the girls turn to them. They look at them. They see them having fun. They see them there with their muscly bodies. And the girls are like, oh, wow. Oh, they're like looking there. And in that same picture, bro number one is with the other dudes trying to be comfortable. He's trying to, what's his name? He's not going out of his comfort zone. He's not trying to start gymming. He's not trying to start athletics. He's not trying to do something else. He's not, it's just there. <sighs> bro number one, bro. A lot of us have been to bro number one and a lot of us have been bro number one, like me, for example. I used to be bro number one, okay? I became bro number two because I fucking put my back into it and I put work into it, bro. You can do the same, okay? It's all about the aspect. Uh, the, it's all about the way you look at everything, okay? And the thing is, bro number two, when he was getting this attention from the girls, did he look at them? Did he even fucking turn his head to them? No! And the girls that were in his field of view, he just smiled at them. Hmm, so what? What's up? And he just continues. He's like, ah, ha, ha, I just love, ha, ha, And he just continues. Just having fun. Or if there's a girl there at the counter, he's talking and talking, talking to his friend. And then there's a girl there and she's like laughing and stuff. And he's like, ha, ha. I think that's funny too. High five. High fucking five. And like, tsh, and like, ah. And he turns around and keeps talking. Then he turns around and he says something funny. Ha, 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 Then he turns around and continues talking. And he goes out with his friend. That's bro two stuff, okay? That's awesome bro two stuff. Bro one stuff is kind of like. It's kind of like, um, he'll be there with his friends and then he'll be like trying to do whatever it takes but like even at the cost of being himself, he's even willing to sacrifice being himself. That's the only thing you mustn't sacrifice, dude. And also as well, like you want to you wanna be as real as flipping possible, okay? Don't fucking lie. Like be for real, okay? And um, you can want something but a man can never... Bros, a woman can never be the apple of your eye, okay? She can never be the center of your attention. She can never be the beat in your heart. Never, never, fucking ever. It's your passion, your passion, your dream, your purpose in life that must be the center of your heart, okay? You are the apple of a woman's eye. You are the center of a woman's attention. You are the beat of her heart, not the other way of fucking round. Hope you bros found this useful. If you have any questions, feel free to ask my brothers. And I hope that you, pr you proceed to succeed and continue being awesome. Hey bros? And you, co you continue to be fucking awesome and like just follow your dreams and be the flip who you are, okay? See you bros. Much love, man.